book of Enoch, chapter 66 and 67. And after that, he showed me the angels of punishment who are prepared to come and let loose all the powers of the waters which are beneath in the earth in order to bring judgment and destruction on all who abide and dwell on the earth. And the Lord of Spirits gave commandments to the angels who were going forth that they should not cause the waters to rise, but should hold them in check. Those angels were over the powers of the waters. And I went away from the presence of Enoch. Chapter 67. In those days, the word of God came unto me, and he said unto me, Noah, thy lot has come up before me, a lot without blame, a lot of love and of righteousness. And now the angels are making a wooden building, and when they have completed the task, I will place my hand upon it and preserve it, and there shall come forth from it the seed of life, and the change shall set in, so that the earth will not remain without inhabitant. And I will make fast thy seed before me forever and ever, and I will spread abroad those who dwell with thee, it shall not be unfruitful on the face of the earth, but it shall be blessed and multiply on the earth in the name of the Lord. And he will imprison those angels who have shown up righteousness in that burning valley which my father Enoch had formerly shown to me in the west among the mountains of gold and silver and iron, soft metal and tin. And I saw that valley in which there was a great convulsion and a convulsion of the waters. And when all this took place from that fiery molten metal and from the convulsion thereof in that place, there was produced a smell of sulphur and it was connected with those waters. And that valley of the angels were led astray, mankind burned beneath the land. And through it, valleys proceed streams of fire where these angels are punished who led astray those who dwell upon the earth. But those orders shall be those days served for the kings and the majority of the exalted and those who dwell on the earth for the healing of the body, but for the punishment of the spirit. Now their spirit is full of lust that they may be punished in their body, for they have denied the Lord of spirits. See their punishment daily. and yet believe not in his name and in protection as the burning of their bodies becomes severe. A corresponding change shall take place in their spirit forever and ever. For before the Lord of Spirits, none shall utter an idle word, for the judgment shall come upon them because they believe in the, hope, in the lust of their body and deny the spirit of the Lord. And those same waters will undergo a change in those days for when those angels are punished in these waters, these water springs shall change their temperature. And when the angels ascend, the waters of the spring shall change and become cold. And I heard Michael answering and saying, the judgment wherewith the angels we judged is a testament for the kings and the mighty who possess the earth. Because these waters of judgment minister to the healing of the body, of the kings and the lust of their body, therefore they will not see, will not believe that those waters change and become a fire which burns forever. <laughs>